Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can create a shared link for your Google Drive folders and files. It's actually quite straightforward once you know how, so let's jump right down into it. So here we have my Google Drive and I have a folder just called memes here, right? It's full of different kind of memes and things like that. And what we want to do is we want to create a share link that allows me to share this with other people, right? So they can access my folder. Maybe we can do some collaborative work. Maybe they can add their own memes and things like that. Now to do this, there's a few different ways. Obviously we can share specific files by right clicking it and I can go ahead and click on the share button we can create a share as an individual or create a copy link where I can share a link directly to that particular file alternatively of course we can share the entire folder by right clicking on the memes folder here coming down to share and then creating uh, clicking on the copy link okay again another great way to do this it's basically the same as clicking this drop down menu as well coming down to share clicking on the share or the copy link information if we click on the share button there it's going to come up with a dialog box here that lets me basically share this with a group of people but we can also copy the link down at the bottom here as well now general access is restricted only people with the link can of course access this folder we come here we can say that anyone with the link right can of course um you know access this particular folder so if we wanted to limit this so we create a, a group of different email addresses we add them all in here it's going to be restricted meaning that this link is only accessible to people who actually are included in my group right however if i wanted it to be absolutely anyone well i can do this and then i can go ahead and copy the link and anyone who gets that link can access this folder okay very important the other option that you have here is whether you want them to just view the, the files that are contained in there whether you want them to be a commentator or maybe an editor as in they can organize add add edit the files right so if we wanted them to be editors anyone with this link can now go ahead and add remove delete edit the files contained within my memes folder here okay now from the purpose of this i'm going to put it back to restricted because i only want it to be people who i allow access to access this particular folder but guys honestly it is as easy as that to create share links and control the permissions as to who can access the files and the folders, but also what level of permission that they have. Can they add, delete, and edit files, or can they just view them? Lots of different options. If you found this useful, informative, maybe it solves your problems, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more hints and tips, and I'll catch you in the next one.